Boom! He's back! In the tube! In the tube of YouTube! On the side of the chilling spot. Beautiful day. We were just in the water, me and the Gavin and Kim. Enjoying the... Trying to catch fish again? Yep. Oh, now you have a natural fishing rod. Yeah, with a sharp tip. With a sharp tip. Anyway, like I said to Kim, it's just a very good vibration. I said, most people do not come out their house today. Most people do not go out, do not, uh, like, they barely go in their backyard. And so. and we're very much, most people are very much hooked on nonsense, TVs and tablets and stuff. And not too many people are reconnecting with, uh, with nature. So that's what I want to promote. No, I promote what I love. So I love the nature vibes. The, the good vibration so that's what i promote you know promote what you love don't bash what you hate you know? promote always always promote what you love if you promote what you love you're in business but if you constantly bash what you hate that's the vibration you will get too so you have to be very careful where, where you put your energy and vibrations very it becomes of utmost important to be very very uh very conscious of where you put your energy and where you put your vibes and what you do with uh, with your vibration you know because we all have a very unique vibrational signature like i've said uh, in the past and it's important to leave that vibrational signature the only way you should sign your nature away is with your vibration that's the only the only time where you should sign your nature away is by leaving your vibrations here and there. I don't know, just make sense of why you're here and uh, go on your journey and uh, that's what I, you know, the journey could be long, it's a long, long thing for sure, and it's a life, it's a life commitment that when you start on a journey, when you start exploring the, the possibilities of who you are, the, all the capabilities that you have, it's very... Uh, it's very, it becomes very intriguing, which most people uh, do not like to step out of their comfort and uh, explore the uncertainty. We prefer known hells to unknown heaven, <laughs> right? Most people prefer known hells to unknown heaven. And I think uh, sometimes there's treasure in, uh, in, play, in unexpected places. You can find treasures in unexpected places if you uh, start seeking. But if you don't seek nothing, like if you don't, uh, if you don't think that life is uh, worth living, uh, you'll probably never, uh, never reach for your greatness. Or uh, so seize the moment. Seize the moment. You know, there's only the now. There's only the now. You can access everything through the now. Also. Once you become conscious of that, that everything you can access is in the here and now, uh, things are changing because from that channel you can explore many, many possibilities, which before you weren't really in touch with. So to me, it's becoming very clearer and clearer and clearer that uh, my journey is becoming clearer for sure. And the more I go on, the less I feel the need to. Uh, to be popular, to be popular if I can say, or to, to have recognition or to, because it's not about me, it's not about me, I don't take any glory, it's not, I give the divine the glory for all the, the, the for the life that I live and the, the strength that I have to carry on this journey, but I don't think, uh, you know, I have rise to the occasion, yeah, but this is something natural that we should all do so uh, to me it's not uh, it's something everything that I had lived before was more unnatural than what I live now so I had to justify my existence much way before through different means of uh, nonsense than today today I just get to be aligned with uh, with nature create an alignment with nature you know be part of something be part of something that is bigger than yourself, very important. Find a cause, 
there's many, many, many cars. You know, there's many cars, not only the the, the motivational uh, speaking and stuff, but there's many, many cars that we should uh, explore. We should explore more the our possibilities and our uh, the alternatives but again alternatives there's many many alternatives in life but you gotta look at the word too alternative you know is it to alter your native way the way the natural way of your being and that's why we have many different alternatives i was thinking about that i'm like okay life is full of alternatives for sure we have different choices it can be can transform from one day to another to different uh, a different vibe but also uh, you know the these alternatives and Kim I was looking at the world at the word alternative alternatives is it to alter you from your natural way of living that's why we have all kinds of alternatives with life to alter us from our native Or it could be something opposite. It could, you could see it as the opposite too of the normal rhythm of life. It's an alternative because we we were born dead with life. So the alternatives would be to move out of this native dead state. Okay, yeah, you can see it this way more. Yeah, so maybe alternatives work can be seen as a constructive way of a... Yeah. I was seeing more the negative way of it and alter us from our native nature. But no, it could be a alter from the program. Now? Fuck off. No. No. But because we got told yesterday that the fish and now there's people coming to fish and Gavin is all discouraged I don't know I'm divided I don't know what to say But yeah, same same thing. Look, they don't come here to empty the river. They don't come here to empty the river. They just come here to have fun and fish a bit and have a. But no, I wouldn't say nothing, Kim. Uh, you know, uh, you need them to be overstand a bit. I don't. I don't know. I wouldn't. No, it's just, it's an ego trip. It's out of ego. Realize it, this is what I mean. Because you take it personal because yesterday they told you. But don't take it personal. That's my point. I see, I see but wait, but that's how I see it. Don't take it personal because now you're involving emotion and you're going to put life energy into this. Because you have to approach the people and you don't know which way they're going to perceive you. Like, is, is she jealous? Is she doing this out of ego? Because they're very programmed. That's what I'm saying, just... Let it be. Yeah. That's how I interact with people more now. I think about it. I'm like, okay. I think of their state of programming. What are they going to think of me if I approach? You know, they could think I'm jealous of them fishing and my son cannot. So. It could be out of ego, you know. And it's out of ego unconsciously also because, you know, I felt like you. I felt like going to tell them, innocent. And we got told yesterday, but I don't know. It's just... Okay, can you warn the whole world, Kim, to not get in trouble? The whole world's in trouble. That's my point. That's my point. Okay, but that's one other person that might not get told now. And getting in trouble, uh, 
like it me what i find interesting is more to watch the development of it see if they're gonna show up again those two bananas to warn them because we're here like yesterday same situation he's not fishing but they're are they gonna show up now that's interesting to see i'm more interested in that than uh, yeah. you know where they are those green bananas now they're not around who's gonna call them and you know i don't know i'm in more interesting in the then go there and break their vibe because it's breaking their vibe they broke our vibe yesterday you see how you felt so you're gonna go there and break their vibes they're just enjoying nature if those two banam want to show up again let it be but if they it's like I, that this is what we do we police each other also like that eh? this is another thing let's to police them but this is what we do this is why it's perpetrated like that Without knowing you, you were going there to police them. Me too, I was going to do the same thing. But just let it be and... Nature will take care of it. He's out.